In today's video, I'm going to be playing Blade Edition Burp, and I was blowing down some volume, and I already played this game a couple times, and I started playing damn level 25. But for the sake of this video, I'm going to be being the level 5 and level 10 trainers. I have tried to defeat level 20 trainers and fail miserably if I'm a higher level than them. And you have to upgrade your bay too. So, yeah. And I want you guys to tell me if you want me to do a challenge where I have to have a certain amount on some stuff like attack, defense, and on speed, you or just all my points and a specific ability, attack, defense, or standard speed. But for now, let's upgrade my defense. And this is how my bay looks. Don't copy me, I just customized it. And I actually got this part on top from defeating a level 10 trainer, so yeah. Lucky me. Yeah. Yeah. And now, after I defeat these two trainers, I will explain how the game works. And when I awaken my bay for no reason. And guys, I didn't mean to awaken, but that works. Now let's go to a level 10 trainer. We're gonna have to play all out. And you don't get these abilities right away because you only get the boost ability. Yeah, I almost lost there, but let's pretend I didn't almost lose back there. Okay, and I didn't know if you guys see what happened, but when I did the boost, this is how the boost looks. But it's because most likely because of the part on the bottom. Then your bay has HP. He just loses HP. I'm gonna bully this guy a little bit. Nah, never mind. I guess you destroyed that. Anyways, I'm gonna go and now I'm showing you. You probably spawn over here somewhere else. And your job is basically to go over here and start bringing these small rocks. Uh, so yeah, so let first of all, let me customize my bay back. You had this general top, general stuff, equip, but unfortunately I deleted it. So yeah. And unfortunately I have a sold those for a thousand, so yeah. And you probably spawn in with this general like I kept rolling. Unfortunately I got a way worse for one. But yeah. I got a tree, this thing. I didn't really like it though. This is the giant proceeds drones that reflect something. Oh, great. I messed up. Guys, when you spin, also read the description and don't be like me, stuck with this. Now I have to get a 500k. Okay. Or something like that, but I'm not going to be able to. I'm figuring out the settings, okay. And this, you also can see upgrades coming in. But yeah. Anyways, I did that by accident. Totally. I have a purpose of my landing here. I'm not going to destroy anyone. But yes, this is where you have to. But also, once you have enough money, you go to these things. You spin stuff, blah, blah, blah. You spin. But because I could afford more, there's another store I had explored this map that much. But this is where I usually go to spin stuff. There's, beware, there's some out or running machines apparently. This is where you could sell some items that you get from these running machines. Anyways, this is the, ch the second cheapest one I believe that you could spin, and then you go around, blah blah blah. And since I could afford this one, I could spin if I wanted to. I believe I already had this one, but a different version of it. Unless they're the same. Let me really check. Yeah, it's a different version. But some of these versions might be wrong. 
Forester, so yeah, beware. You can customize your bait however you want in this game. And furthermore, now to explain how I got this. If I didn't, because I don't remember. But. So you see my bait? Yeah. Well, I got this bait by just battling a level 10 trainer. Which I guess you could get from any NPC with, if you're lucky enough. But yeah. Yeah. So if you're going to be banning on NPCs and you don't know that's a future, you probably could get be, get lucky and get something very good, like I did. But anyways, this is the end for today's video. See you in the next one.